Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another home video tour. This is the newest community built by Beezer. We're talking about gross, crosswind estates. This is the Dawson floor plan. I've never toured this one before, so I'm excited to show it to you. It's a three bedroom up to four bedrooms, but I really like the three bedroom option. 2,100 square feet. Now, we are located in Henderson. To be specific, we are in the southeast side of the Las Vegas Valley. And uh, this is more of, uh, you know, there's no master plan community out here, but we do have right across the street, one of the biggest parks in the Clark County uh you know area and we have what's called the heritage park and uh in these lots depending on which lot you get some of those lots down there they'll get a beautiful unobstructed strip view from this house from this single story uh good size lots lot premiums are going for about 20 grand this specific home starts at five hundred and thirty thousand dollars that's before you put in any upgrades in it they have one of these homes available at around six hundred thousand at the lower price um, what else? We have also uh, some other floor plans here. We have the Willow floor plan. It starts at 500,000. It's a little bit smaller, about uh, 17, 69 square feet. And then we have the Everett floor plan, which is the biggest one. It starts at 560, uh, but that Everett has also an option to do a second story with an extra bedroom and loft upstairs. It's really nice. But I've taken a video of those. Just look up Everett, uh, uh, Jack Graham, and you'll find the floor plan. You can see here the Dawson is 2,100 square feet. A beautiful floor plan as well. I'm excited to show it to you. Let's go in. So they have one available right now, 598. A uh, lot premiums are going for 20,000 or so. If you think of the pricing right here with 530 starting price with the lot premium 550 plus upgrades. Uh, you should expect to spend about 600000 600, with this house. As soon as you walk in, you have two bedrooms on the left. You have a bathroom in between. First bedroom is a 10 by 12, 10 by 13. Very spacious. Sliding door closet and yeah, pretty much all upgraded carpet, paint, flooring, everything. This one has also a nice uh, linen closet to the left single base the single sink and the fiberglass tub and shower combo <clears throat> as you go into the second bedroom this one is pretty spacious too that's about 11 by 12 maybe 11 by 13 really spacious room this one has the uh, uh, attic access now what's cool about these it's uh what they do is it's a foam insulation in your attic and your attic is also insulated so you see that foam right there that is against your roof so you're getting the best insulation that you can get pretty much uh, with any builder out there and i like that they are opening this up and showing it to people because this is really important the uh, amount of insulation you get in this house is it, i mean the, the quality of insulation is way better than any other builder out there i'll say i think only one other builder does this as of right now you can see here the exterior walls are also going to have um you can see the wind resistant and waterproofing and also your blown in insulation into the walls this is a really good uh, quality one and then you have also your chicken wire with the what's it called uh, your insulation and finally your concrete stucco outside Okay, really nice house. Energy efficient. I mean, this is the most energy efficient builder in town uh, as of uh, as of last year. That's what the that's what the rating said as far as energy efficiency. It's called Sear. See here the Willow plan. We're not in the Willow right now, but you can see a little bit dimensions and everything. And then we have the Dawson plan. This is where we're in right now. We saw the two bedrooms up front. We're in the garage. We're gonna go back into the main room. And then this would be the Everett that has an option to get a loft upstairs. This would be the door leading you into the house. But we're going to go this way. And that would be that door. So you walk into the house. You have a little valet area with a powder room.
look at that huge open floor plan this one feels very spacious the flow of this house is amazing look how much open space we have here some might think all oh, this is kind of you know wasted square footage or whatever that's true i mean it is a little bit wasted but when i walk in here i see wide open beautiful flow in the house so really like it um i'll tell you what you can do with this one to get the fourth bedroom uh you have a washer and dryer over here to the left a rack above this would be your um your hvac system and then over here what you can do is in place of this valet area you can make a fourth bedroom in here which will push the kitchen up a little bit it will turn this uh island 90 degrees facing out over here so you would lose about eight feet here in the kitchen and it's still fine it will, it will look great once you think about it the kitchen would probably be somewhere over here okay so this this would be the 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 back cabinets of the kitchen and then the island would be coming out over here so maybe yeah about over here this much and this would be a still nice open floor plan you have your dining room over here living room over there and then island facing over to the living room if you need the fourth bedroom but i really like how this one kind of stands out to me this floor plan because of the fact that it has this huge open floor plan when you don't get the fourth bedroom which is really nice pantry walk in beautiful this one uh they have an option to get a nice electric con induction cooktop these are really nice, expensive uh, convection oven built in and then microwave above. You can do a canopy hood and all that good stuff if you want to upgrade. Island is a good size. You got three chairs over here, but at 600,000 for this house, got to be honest, guys, I got a better deal just around the corner. I mean, at 660,000, I'll give you 2,500 square feet instead of this much way higher quality of construction inside, in my opinion. But you know, to find out that you got to reach out to me so I can get you to the perfect home for you to get you the best deal possible out here. Let's get back to the video. Still 600,000 uh, 600, is a good value, but I think we can get do we can do better on this one. Dining room, living room, they're open to offer. So if you like it, we can definitely get you one of these homes. Look at this king size bed. About 14 on that wall by approximately 17 on this one. Pretty roomy. And then two undermount sinks, luxury vinyl plank. You have the walk-in shower to the right. Glass enclosure, fiberglass pan. Water closet, linen closet. And then this is actually really spacious. Look at that. Huge closet, and then you can even add some racks over here. At least for him, you know. A really nice setup on this house. 2,100 square feet. You won't get a bigger open floor plan than this in this square footage of a house. I do like how this uh, living room is tucked away as well. It's perfect the way this couch is against the wall. Overseeing the TV. Plenty of windows. See window above the sink over there. And then another two over here, another one there, and your slider. Let's go out to the backyard and show you the size of the backyards as well as the views, if I can. So, covered patio is included, by the way. Backyard is not going to be landscaped. It's going to have just dirt back here. Just consider people are putting in about $50,000 in upgrades in this house or the spec homes. They're putting that much, but you can do a lot less. If you want to build from dirt, you can see here, good size backyard, definitely plenty of room here. We have about 25 feet. Uh, you can get lots that go up to about 50 feet in depth. So twice the size of this backyard, if you wanted to. Also, if you get a lot on this side of the community, on this side of the community, you'll get a view fence. And in this case, we do have a, a, a building on the other side, which is part of the, what's it called? The Heritage Park. And that's why we don't have the strip views, but you can kind of see through it a little bit. What is that? Is that the, the wind or something? I don't know. That's where the strip is. If you get one of those lots over there, you can see it perfectly. So also you get mountain views on that side. 
and the mountain views on this side. That's uh, that's where Black Mountain is right there. So really nice, quiet part of town, a little bit more on the outskirts of the city. You're in the city of Henderson and um, you have the Heritage Park right across the street from you. Really nice uh, area and part of town in the southeast of the valley. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Is this a good price or not? Personally, after I just toured right now some beautiful model homes over there uh, with this other builder, I, I think this is overpriced personally. But, you know, I always tell you guys the truth on my channel. That's just the way I am. Uh, I can't lie. So if I see something that's overpriced, I got to say it. I love Beezer. It's a great builder. They do a really good job with the quality, with the quality of the materials that they use in it. The insulation is amazing. One of the best, insula the, the best insulation that you can get on any other builder. But 600,000 for 2100 square feet seems like a little bit of a stretch. I would say this is like perfect price for this would be around 550. But, you know, I'm just a realtor, you know, just doing my job. So if you guys want uh, and you still like this floor plan, I can definitely help you put in uh, an offer on this to get you one of these homes and uh, get you the best price possible. And, uh, you know, showing all the comps and everything to the builders to understand, hey, this is not, this is just overpriced, you know. But they haven't opened yet, so maybe that's why they have a little bit of higher prices. We'll see what happens. If you guys are interested in these homes, all my information is down below in the description. Uh, you can also check out my two links, one for new homes and one for resale houses, so you can start your search there. Subscribe to the channel to get all the new construction home tours in Las Vegas Valley, and we'll see you in the next video.